All right, well, the weekend is here and one East Valley City is just hours away from a big celebration. Tomorrow you can celebrate Mesa. They're returning to Pioneer Park. It is a free event for the entire family. That is where we find Team 12's Jen Wall live for us this morning. Jen, tell us what's happening out there this weekend. Yeah, good morning to you both. There's going to be so much happening here at Pioneer Park in Mesa. It is a free event for the family. There's going to be carnival rides, a petting zoo, all kinds of things. If you're into Disney, your favorite characters from Encanto are going to be here. And joining me live with the city of Mesa is Donna. Thank you so much for being here. So how is sustainability being featured in this event? We have such a fun area that we are calling the Living Green Village. We have almost 30 exhibitors who will be joining us from you know, educators, nonprofits, businesses that all do green type of, of programming and things like that, sustainability. And one of them we have with us here today, one of the groups. I'm so excited to have the EVIT fashion students here with us today talking about recycled fashion. I love that. Anytime we can focus on sustainability in our community, especially with up and coming generations, is something we love to feature. And joining me live this morning, we have Brenna and Zamara. Thank you so much for being here. So you have zero waste, sustainable fashion, and a laundry lab, all from EVIT. Tell me all about it, Brenna. Yeah, so we're part of the fashion design and merchandising program at the East Valley Institute of Technology. And we're here to kind of promote our booth, which is going to showcase our products, our zero waste products, and also our sneak peek fashion show that will be at Celebrate Mesa at noon. So don't miss it. All right. Thank you so much, Brenna. Zamara, you guys have created some really cool pieces of fashion that you're both wearing. Tell me about that. So this piece was actually inspired by a product that we did for the Phoenix Art Museum for, for subversive fashions. Um, we were really just trying to point out the oppression of women. And yeah, that was the idea behind this. So beautiful. I love that. You know, I, I'm really good at going and picking out pieces, but creating something, I can't even imagine what goes into that. So Brenna, how did you create what you are wearing and what we see here and, and why zero waste fashion? Yeah, so this is actually one of the first things I created in the program. My idea was I want to create the coolest thing I can think of out of scraps. This is all made out of, you know, things we've had in the classroom for years. And I was super excited to just, you know, make something sustainable and not create more waste that the fashion industry creates. I love that. And hopefully we see you both continuing to do this down the road. Also love when I can go to the store and buy clothes that have the recycled information on the tag as well. All right, coming up live at 630, we're going to have much more from Pioneer Park, but everything kicks off here in Mesa tomorrow from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Again, it's free. You can go to City of Mesa's website to find out more about it. Fun stuff happening in Mesa this weekend, Jen. Thank you.